Hello everybody, it's Mindy and I am here with another Francesca's Studio Works diamond painting to show you. Completed! Yes, completed. So you can see how cute this is and how good this turns out. All right, so I have notes for this because I have notes from the company. Now the company themselves feel that they are trying to work on as many of the diamond paintings as they can because they wanna see how they're turning out. They wanna see if there's any places that could use a tweak or not, or you know, hands-on, hands-on experience, and they're totally open to any um, opinions or questions about any of the paintings. Trying to make the best product possible, the best experience possible with diamond painting. So I have this one and this one was worked on by the company themselves and I have notes about how that experience went and what they felt about it. Okay, first of all, it's a smaller diamond painting. I will of course link the unboxing. It'll probably be up in the eye over there. I'll link the unboxing for you so you can see it from the start to now it's finished. So it's a nice size diamond painting. The information is down here. It's a 40 by 56. It's a Makiko licensed to Francesca Studio Works. I love the size of it. Got a thumbnail picture there. Of course, we have our legends on both sides. This one's right side up and this one's reversed upside down. Um, everything is super nice about this. The nice uh, soft back. It lays nice and flat. It looks beautiful. It looks great. I think it is adorable. First of all, um, started and finished, 19 days. It is square drills. Um, there's a lot of color blocking, color blocking, color blocking. That's why it went so quickly in 19 days because there is a ton of color blocking on this one. Um, there was some confetti in you know a few places. So you'll get a little bit of the confetti mix if you like that, but lots of color blocking. Okay, um, the fit on the drills is super, super nice. Let me bring you up really close and look at how well those drills fit together. It's a nice tight fit. And I know we talked about it with the last painting I showed you um, to make sure that you like use a roller when you're done because Sometimes we think we get those drills down just perfect, but they may be tilted just a little, a little edge is up, or maybe it's touching the drill next to it just a little bit. Go over them with a roller and really get them firmly planted into that glue, seated in that glue. And it makes a wonderful painting when you do that. You can actually hear some crackles sometimes. I think I have my drills placed perfectly and they're all down where they're supposed to be and you'll feel if like you run your hand over it you'll feel like oh wait wait there's something right there one is just raised up just a corner of it or maybe it's just touching the drill next to it a little too much so go over it with a roller and all those will just snap down into place exactly where they're supposed to be um, this canvas was single placed the entire canvas single placed no multi-placer used at all um everything was accounted for everything was in the box as it should be i hope so because i'd opened it first before i returned it <laughs> glad to hear everything was back in the box <laughs> um there was a little bit of static when kitting up the other two kits that i have to talk about because i have two more um really didn't have static like very very little static wasn't a problem at all okay so let's talk about the one issue. And um, I will say I was brought into the conversation and asked some questions about it. And that is, this is charted from the image. This is what the image looks like. If you look at the image that Makiko drew, it's charted to match that. Now, because of drill colors, something happened here in the pom-pom where the pom-pom got a little lost in the painting. Um, I can see it. I mean, I can see the gray wisps coming out and there are multiple colors in here. So if we bring you up really close, there are several colors in that pom-pom. There's at least two colors in the pom-pom itself in the center, two or three. 
And then we have these grays. Well, because of the light background blending with a light gray pom-pom, it's supposed to be a very light gray pom-pom, they kind of blend it a little bit. So there was some discussion about possibly um, changing a couple of colors here so this wasn't quite as washed out, so it didn't blend into the background as much by adding um, a, a couple of different colors in here to make it stand out a little bit better. But I mean, seriously, I think it's just adorable. You can tell, you can clearly tell that there's a pom-pom on top of that hat, right? You can tell. Could it stand out a little bit better? No, eh, maybe. So that is something that the company is definitely looking into if they reprint this one and um, how they can make that just a little more pop, okay? Um, ABs, how many ABs did it have? It had three ABs, a pink, a red, and a white. So the white, 5200, is all these little spots. See all the little spots of snow? Those are the white AB. And over here, we get some of the pink ABs are in this area here and through here. There's more, of course. I'm just giving you some highlights. The pink kind of comes through here. And all of the little white snow spots are AB. The red, of course, is here on the heart, right? Of course. There's pink AB that runs through here. They're, they're really popping out. I can see them really well. There's some pink ABs through here. And like these little spots on the hat are pink AB. And of course, all of those little snow spots. There's more of the pink AB up in here and through here and around the hat. So it is super pretty. Some white ABs in the eyes. Of course, in the eyes. Why not? Isn't it adorable? Let's look, let's get you up here really close so you can look up close. Look how nice this looks. Single placing. I got to hand it to the people who single place. I mean, it looks really, really nice single place. There's very, very little gapping in any of these. The drills are fitting together nicely. I just don't have the patience for single placing. So, you know, yay. Yay for those people who do. Look how good that looks, right? Look how good that looks. All right, I'm going to let you look at it for a minute because I'm going to talk to you about a couple things. There are some deals going on at, Frances at, at Francesca's right now. I'm going to talk about them. And I'm going to link their Facebook page below so that you can go to the Facebook page and see these deals for yourself, okay? I'm not certain how long the deals run. One, I think, is all month, but... I. Don't quote me. You'll have to go check them out for yourself. So the first deal that's going right now is Year of the Dragon, because this is the Year of the Dragon. And there's several dragon paintings at Francesca's. But they're running a special because it's Year of the Dragon. Um, and it's free shipping on orders over $130. If you spend $130, you will get free shipping. Yay! Who doesn't love that, right? So that's deal number one. And the code for that is DRAGON. It's all capital letters. Like I said, I'll link the Facebook group below so you can go check out all these specials for yourself. Um, the second one is called Share the Love. Now, Share the Love is when you buy um, Penguin Love and Bearing Gifts, which I showed you last time. You buy those two together and you'll save 25% by buying both. Buy one, get one 25% off. That's how it is. Buy one, get the other one 25% off. And the code for that is two hearts. I mean, because we got two hearts, right? They're both heart. They're both very Valentine-y kind of paintings. So I'm certain that, that probably runs until Valentine's. But again, like I said, check the Facebook group for all the details just to make sure. And deal number three is the storage boxes. And that is a BOGO. It's buy one, get one half off, I think. Or is it buy one, get one I, you'll have to check. Just check. It's a deal on the storage boxes, and it is um, BOGO box. So check that out in the Facebook group. Okay, so we got some deals going here, you guys. You can um, save yourself some money, get yourself some fantastic paintings, pick up some cute dragon paintings or some Valentine-themed paintings, um, and get a good deal on them. 
Isn't it adorable though? I mean, you know, I love Makiko. I did the Makiko snowman and child. I, I love Makiko's work. And this is just adorable. Those big eyes and that cute little nose peeking through there, his beak, you know, it's adorable. And I love the ABs, the snow coming down with the ABs. It's just gorgeous. What more can we say? You want to see sparkle? You know, let's, let's see if we can get sparkle here. Let's see. Let's see what we can do for you. You know, it's square drills. And I will say round drills sparkle more than square. I, I mean, they just, they do. But this one is pretty shiny and pretty sparkly itself. It's super. Look, look. See? See the sparkles? Look at them. That's what we like about diamond painting, right? Is that sparkle. It's amazing. It's just amazing how these little pieces of plastic with facets on them make such sparkly, pretty pictures. It's amazing. So there it is, folks. Um, now you've seen it from beginning to end. What do you think? I hope you can take advantage of some of those deals. Let me know if you do. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. And hit that like button, subscribe button, and all those things. And remember, I will have the unboxing linked up in the eye, and I'll have the Facebook group linked below. So you can check out those deals for yourself. All right. I will talk to everybody soon. I hope you have a great day. And hey, happy Valentine's Day. If I don't talk to you before then, happy Valentine's Day. <laughs>